Oh, you mentioned fall. Fall's officially here, and it's time to treat your taste buds to the flavors of the season. My friends from Aqua Grill are putting a new spin on fall cuisine. Here to share it with us, joining us right now, Chef Mike and Carrie Hart, who's the owner of Aqua Grill. Hey, guys, welcome back. Good to have you here. Thanks for having us again. So I'm going to start with Chef. Absolutely. You've got swordfish, but with a fall twist. What's the fall twist? Absolutely. We've got some uh, roasted pumpkin bisque, some shaved Brussels sprouts, <coughs> excuse me, and uh, some Spanish chorizo sausage. Um, all we got from the local farmer market, farmer's market uh, yesterday, and the uh, swordfish came from Fisherman's Dock. We picked up our this morning on our way in. Oh, you know, and, and when it comes to fish, there's nothing better than fresh. And actually, the veggies and stuff, too. Absolutely. You've got to have fresh. Um, everything we do is uh, fresh, made to order. Um, really looking forward to getting into this heartier food, the squashes and everything for the fall season. All right, so you're starting uh, by sautéing up the, uh, the swordfish there. How do you make sure you've got a really good piece of swordfish? Uh, you touch it, it should bounce back really quick. If mm -hmm. the, the fish is whole, you can look at its eyes, tell how uh, fresh it is. The eyes should be nice and clear, uh, no opaqueness to it. Um, and if you go to the fisherman's dock, of course, it's going to be fresh. Absolutely. So, Gary, what else is uh, good for fall, you know, as we transition to that new season? You, you know, it's the, like Mike said, the heartier food here. You know, we're doing a lot of, uh, you know, kind of braising with some, some meat, some short ribs and stuff like that. We have uh, short ribs on our wine dinner that comes up in November. We have our uh, specialty ad hoc dinner, which has got a lot of fall influences, uh, a lot of uh, southern flair, cosmopolitan indulgences. So, I mean, the thing about fall is I think there's a lot of more celebrating going on. I think people start getting f the taste of the holidays coming on and... You know, it just gets a little more festive uh, at that time of year, and, and people aren't, you know, in that bikini weather, you know, so they don't have to worry so about it. So you can have the heartier meals and not worry about it. Exactly. Oh, exactly. Um, by the way, I hear a rumor. You guys have been in the same place for 26 years. You're getting a brand-new ultra-modern facility right next door? Yeah, we're in the process of making the final uh, arrangements, you know, but our center right now, Sargas Village, is, is, is becoming uh, a redevelopment, and uh, it's exciting about that. And Aqua Grill, after 26 years being there, Probably in a year or so, we'll have a brand new Aqua Grill and uh, modern, contemporary. It's, just, it's going to be really exciting. Uh, what we're doing now is great, but uh, you know, to have the opportunity to refresh it a little bit after 26 years is going to be something that we're uh, delighted about and looking and, and forward to. And Mike gets to pick out the Tupperware. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's get back to the dish here. You, you, you sautéed the swordfish. How, how long on each side? Um, this is a pretty thick piece, so this one we did about five to six minutes on each side. Any seasonings? Uh, Real simple, salt and pepper, a little mm -hmm. bit of uh, seasoned flour. So basically what you want to do is, is have the veggies and, and the sausage and the pumpkin flavors come through. All together, yes. How about putting together the pumpkin bisque? What's the secret? Um, pumpkins roasted off, a little bit of chicken stock, garlic, shallots. Um, cook it all down and just finish it with a little bit of cream and butter at the end. All right, so you, you've got two things you can do here. If you'd like to cook it yourself, this recipe will be on our recipes section at newsforjacks.com. Or stop by, and Chef Mike will do the cooking for you, and Carrie will actually come by and clean and wash the plates and do all that stuff. Aqua Grill over there off A1A in... Ponte Vedra Beach. Oh, right I thought there. you were looking at me because I said you were going to do the dishes. <laughs> What's that? Yeah, Sign I'm... of a good boss is to be there for the entire process. I'm right? there. Oh, I've seen him do the dishes before. He's always there. Excellent. Yeah.